Cooper is back in the Class 3A tournament after winning the title in their first appearance last year. Here's Jay Wilcox with more on the Hawks. Thrilling, nerve-wracking, heart-stopping. Cooper's 52-51 win over Waconia in the Section 6 final was all of the above. It was very intense. Um, in the end, we were like almost crying because we was fighting for that game and uh, we worked hard, so we got what we wanted and what we deserved. We've played a lot of close games this year, so learning how to grind it out and come out on top, you know, when things aren't going our way or even being down with just a couple seconds left. And, you know, I think Asia Wheeler speaks for herself being a senior. You know, she was ready. The Hawks are the number two seed for the state 3A tournament. They drew Austin, a team they don't know much about, in the quarterfinals. It could be hard. Sometimes, you know, we don't know like what they usually run, what defense they run. But we're going to come out and play our game. Most of the players in Cooper's rotation played at least some in the state tournament last season, so they know what to expect. Um, I think it's very helpful because like, we know what to expect, what the court feels like, what the crowd feels like, so we won't be nervous, we'll be ready. It hasn't been all smooth sailing this season, but Cooper's now in good position to shoot for a repeat in Class 3A. Jay Wilcox, CCX Sports. Cooper and Austin play at 2 o'clock Wednesday afternoon at Maturi Pavilion at the U of M.